Hey guys, Double here, and welcome back to Pokemon Prism. In the last part, we came back to Firelight Caverns. And in this part, we're going to continue. Also off screen, I found black glasses, which I pointed out where they were in editing, hopefully. I remember to do that. Um, and I also found a PP app, which was in the room prior to this. This is a maze now. Amazing! <laughs> No, that just led me back to the start. Well, not really the start, but you know what I mean. Uh, here we go. Lots of mazes. It's not really a maze. Ah, uh, blue. I'm gonna switch because I have Hobbs in the lead so I could run from stuff. Okay. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Hobbs would have been useful. Oh well, I want Togepi to evolve. Bullet punch. Bullet bullet punch. You know, I like how a few episodes ago when I was talking about um. Togetic and being on a, or it not really being useful for future gyms because I've already done dark and fighting. I completely forgot Dragon, which was like the main point of Barry being introduced. And I also didn't use like Bug or anything for um, the um, flying half. So, like, although Bug, I'd have Hobbs. Wait, why did I go- <sighs> Why did I go to Pupitar? Yeah. Now I have to go run back out unless I have revives. Tentacruel's actually a pain to deal with with my team. Steel. Oh, I thought that's a soul eater for some reason. I was gonna be like, wow, we going full anime here. I guess Hobbs had Thunder Fang and he's pretty fast, but it's the, like that basically has to one-shot it for it to be viable. Go back. Well, too bad you're dead. Missed. So I'm guessing I have to fight the ones I didn't fight in the catacombs, because I don't think I fought the pink or blue ones in there. <sighs> this is really annoying. I wish there was a Pokemart out there too. Because like even though I don't have a ton of money, I still would like to get potions. I guess now I could go probably just as quick go back to the whatever the town at the fighting gym is called. In fact it might actually be quicker because I don't have to go through the national park that way. And you're done. But I don't really remember who I fought. I'm not completely sure what the boss has been up to. Color me curious, huh? Why would you walk all the way around like that? Do I have any revives? Yes, I have three. Oh. And the moon milk at the top. I have four of those left. So basically, as soon as I'm out of here, I should fly some. Oh no. I should fly some to uh, those Spurge City I got them in, the department store. And you're 
orange or red? Oh wait, orange doesn't exist. <laughs> that was me cosplaying, so I finally fight red with the rest of them. Nice of leaf blades in this game. They had a drain punch, so why not add leaf blade? I just mostly don't want to be stuck with razor leaf for the rest of the game. And I'm gonna have to heal leaf here. Luckily, red's probably not gonna have much that Leafeon can really help with. I don't think there's many rock or water or ground. No, can't think of much stuff that's weak to uh, grass that's red aside from Sorok. I guess a uh, Volcanion, but. He's not gonna have a Volcanion. Oh, Sea King, damn it. <laughs> sea King's orange, that's. no. Get out of here with that. I should have the Sea King. How do you guys feel that I got one of your buds arrested? Even aware that was me? Damn it. Super effective? What type of storm front? Uh, you have a move that goes first, so you should be able to take out. Never mind. See, in this context, Endure is just wasting time because I killed it before it got to do anything aside from Endure anyway. And Arcanine. And last one's gonna be Flareon. I don't think I fought Green in a while though. Like, did I fight him last time? I'm pretty sure I didn't. Oh yeah, I did because I wanted to do Leafeon versus Leafeon, right. And I probably commented on how Pupitar's not green. Yeah, I wanted to do Leafeon versus Leafeon, but Leafeon was almost dead. Again! Wasting time! Like, sure, if you have some really powerful priority move, which don't exist, um, then, sure, go ahead and do that. My father. Well, I do kind of look like Lance. Oh. Did someone die? Yeah, if Zoro died. Yes, Zoro died. Sorry, Zoro, for forgetting you died. And I do have a hyper potion. So what's this way? Because oh, just a loop. Okay. <laughs> Andy. Veranius. Oh, all of them did? Oh, never mind. They're traitors, apparently. Oh. So, is this, like, the climax of this team? Because, like, they lost all the... Technically two, because Red's not going to leave them. Or if Red does, they'd be dead. Oh, 
Do I have to battle this Varanius guy? You look kind of weird, dude. <laughs> look like a weird bear thing. Good. Sniffs. I am special, apparently. TV. Oh! <laughs> Is that different depending on who you picked for your character? <laughs> Thank you for teleporting me out of there. Oh. Well, it looks like we're getting a lot of story stuff. This whole region is the fire type's ideal environment. The get region that basically starts with an ice root. Varanius, Rawato, Lebeel, Fembaco. That was probably the easiest one to say, and I struggled the most with it. Well, there's still the scientists left, so it's not like we're done with the evil teams. So the BL would be water type. I guess the other one he just described that I forgot the name of was flying. D didn't he only do three? And obviously this one's just fire. Ooh. Hid the orbs. Well, that guy kind of just took them. <sighs> nice. Oh. Where is my father? <laughs> Or did they just replace Lance's sprite with this sprite, and I don't want to bring him? Find a way to head north. I can think of one place, maybe. I'm not sh don't can't really think of how to get there though. See what I'm thinking is um move Pokemon and Geodude Spiro. I'll just have Spiro in the lead because I'm probably gonna switch him out for Geodude as soon as I'm here. Go to Laurel City. I think you guys know where I'm thinking about. 
I thought it was like in the middle of that Magikarp cave though. But the map seems to imply it's not. It's my lowest level. You know what, Egbert? You're just getting too strong. Like, I want to evolve Egbert, but I think I'll just take advantage of step the steps. Is it in here? Oh wait, this is Magikarp, isn't it? Yeah, I don't want to do that again. I'm pretty sure I have to though, damn it. <laughs> What's this again? Scientist place? <sighs> you know what? I'll be right back. Guess when I'm there, I'm gonna just look at a guide. Oh, I can't even. I can't even do it. So there was this, but I can't use strength yet. get that item ball. I mean, I'm sure I can. They wouldn't just place a pointless item ball somewhere. <gasps> it was you. Oh, this cave. Turn on. Nope. Okay, then. Never mind. No idea where to go, then. <sighs> this game, even when it gives you a hint, it's a bad hint. Is there anywhere I can go north? Okay, I've been as north as I can, aside from this route, which I don't know why I thought I could do that anyway. Unless he meant north of where we were, which would mean the Laurel or Arcania Dock. <sighs> to a guide! So, hopefully I can find a national park. I'm really doubting I can. <sighs> I wish he said north of here. Or, like, was more specific of, like, need to get to Acania Dock. Because this is a pain. Oh, now I'm gonna have to probably go back through that stupid cave again. Except I guess I can buy stuff. Nope. Ah, damn it. <laughs> well, two... Spurge City. Okay. Let's go get that bridge built. Yes. How did I get 20... Br How did I get that from 20 brick pieces? <laughs> A damp rock. Is that even in this game, or did they add, like pointless item, because I'm pretty sure that, yeah, makes Rain Dance last eight turns. <laughs> okay. Well, anyway, next time on Pokemon Prism, we will explore the Akania Docks. See you guys then.